What's going on everyone, Sam here. We're talking about old world versus new world wines and how to get into the old world if you're so used to drinking things from like California, Australia, maybe even Oregon as well. The big part about old world wines we think about is they're central to Europe. And in Europe, it's a much cooler climate, which means instead of the grapes getting overly ripe and really fruity, you end up with a very more or a more earth tone style wine. But if you're trying to get into old world wines, I always say stick with the same varietal. I think of Pinot Noir right away because Pinot Noir in California is very ripe and fruit forward. But Pinot Noir in Burgundy and things like in France, they have a lot of ripeness to them too, but the earth tones kind of creep in, creep in. And slowly but surely, you'll start finding wines within Burgundy that you'll really enjoy. So Pinot Noir is a great step forward, but then you'll start getting into your Cabernets, your Merlots, and everything else that comes out of the old world where it really all began you'll start finding more wines that you really enjoy. But start with Pinot Noir, and I promise you won't go back.